Hey everyone, Scott here from the Fragrance Channel, Scott Aromatico. Welcome again. Thank you so much for joining me for yet another fragrance review. I am super excited about this company I'm here to talk about. As you can tell from the thumbnail, today I'm going to be talking about Scent Journey. When I tell you so many amazing fragrances have come out in the past year, I have added so many awesome ones from 2022 to my collection. You know, we have the Zed Creators, to name a few. Absolutely spectacular. One of my favorite pickups from 2022 so far was this one right here by Stefan Uber Lucas called God of Fire. This one is absolutely succulent, spectacular, fresh, gorgeous in every way. And here I go. 2023, I have picked up another fragrance from last year that has knocked my socks off. Spoiler alert, I'm already going to tell you right up front. This fragrance has blown me away. And that, of course, is Cocktails and Catamarans by Scent Journey. For those of you who don't know and are brand new to the fragrance community, maybe you've never heard of Scent Journey. You've heard of the big boys, right? You've heard of all the designer fragrances. You've heard of the big companies like Killian in the niche realm, right? You've heard of Killian. You've heard of Amouage. You've heard of Zhirzhov and so many other ones, but there's so many small indie niche houses that are just doing it right, and Scent Journey is one of those houses. Now, Scent Journey was born out of their love for traveling, and in particular, really that beach life, right? We all love those beach vibes, hanging out by the ocean, listening to the waves crash, hearing the sound of the gulls, children at play. It's just such a relaxing atmosphere. I absolutely love it. It is one of my places where I go zen. I love the beach and I'm sure a lot of you do too. So this company was born out of a love for travel. And like I said, in particular, you know, that beach life and also just out of their love and passion for creating amazing original fragrances. And who doesn't love that? So there you have Scent Journey Born out of those amazing inspirations. So today we're talking about cocktails and catamarans. And when I got my fragrance in the mail, it came with one full bottle presentation and a bunch of samples in this tin right here. There's so many amazing samples in here. And I only tested one. And so far, I am going to buy that fragrance. And that is Siesta Sunset. Absolutely amazing. That's going to be my next purchase. So definitely check out Siesta Sunset. But like I said, we are talking about cocktails and catamarans. This one came out last year. If you want to pick up a bottle or want to find out anything more about Scent Journey and a lot of their offerings, I'll leave a link in the description down below. But for a 50 ml that came in this box, you can pick it up for around 120 bucks. And the perfumer is Anthony Lane. Let's go ahead and show you the presentation. Now, as of this video coming out right now, you are going to get a totally different presentation, which is absolutely amazing. That's one of the things I love about companies. A good company is always moving forward, is always improving, is always progressing, and never staying stagnant. And Scent Journey is no different. They are changing the presentation of their fragrances. I got an old presentation because I ordered it right before the change because I couldn't wait. You know, I'm very impatient when it comes to my fragrances. I'm like a nine-year-old on Christmas. But anyways, let me show you this old presentation. And then after I'm done showing you this, I'll put on the new presentation on the screen so you can see that you're getting something a little bit more luxurious which I think fits this fragrance because it is a very luxurious, amazing vacation vibes, tropical fragrance. All right. So it comes in tissue like this little sticker that says scent journey. And then when you unwrap, you got the box that looks like this. Now this is the old presentation. You're going to be getting something different on the back. You've got some pertinent information like the ingredients and whatnot. Now this is a sleeve that just slides out and inside you have the beautiful bottle of cocktails and catamarans. All right, let's show you the bottle a little bit up close. The beautiful blue bottle kind of invokes those deep blue Caribbean waters that we've all come to love when we see them in photographs or in movies or on pictures or maybe some of you have been to the Caribbean and uh, you just can't stop thinking about those blue waters. This one definitely invokes that. And if I didn't say it already, cocktails and catamarans, the name and the scent is meant to invoke a trip or a journey around the islands, you know, just listening to those beautiful steel drums play and just being captured by the beauty of the Caribbean on a nice catamaran sailboat. That is what this fragrance is meant to invoke. Let's go ahead and smell the fragrance and I'll give you my impressions and then we'll read the notes and I'll tell you a little bit more about the fragrance.
this fragrance is one of those fragrances that's going to put you in a good mood. It is going to take you to your happy place. I highly suggest getting this for when you go on vacation because every time you smell this smell, you are going to smile and remember your amazing memories you had on vacation. Right away, you get an amazing, bright burst of grapefruit, zesty, sweet, gorgeous grapefruit, so, so succulent. And then my nose just picks up a whole lot of gorgeous, mouth-watering, intoxicating pina colada. And I've worn this fragrance like multiple times, two or three times, because I really wanted to live with it. And one of the things about this fragrance is that pina colada note really just seems to stay with the fragrance for the duration of the wearing. And trust me when I tell you, this fragrance lasts a long time, but we'll get into that a little bit more. As this fragrance starts to develop, you're really picking up these bright, airy, fresh aldehydes in this fragrance. Just, just smells so good. It really helps make this fragrance sparkle and shine. And then you start to pick out the creamy, juicy melon note that you've ever smelled in a fragrance. And also, a note that I really pick up in this fragrance that's not listed in the ingredients is a pineapple note that just seems to really go so well with that pina colada note. And then I'm picking up a whole lot of milky coconut, at least to my nose. This fragrance is just so gorgeous and so sweet, but it's not sugary sweet. The fragrance starts to get down to the base and the dry down. You really start to pick up some woodiness coming from cedar, a little bit of amber that helps warm up the fragrance. And this has a nice, beautiful, soft, woody-like ambroxan that really just helps balance out the fragrance and also really gives this fragrance a whole lot of life. All right, let's take a look at the notes. You guys can follow along with me on the screen. In the top, we have blood orange. We've got beautiful mandarin orange, sweet green apple, bright bergamot, zesty grapefruit, and like I, had, like I said, some fresh sparkling aldehydes. In the mid or the heart of this fragrance, you have pina colada. We have that creamy, juicy melon, coconut, lavender, and some white flower accord. In the base, we have tonka, which gives it a vanillic-like scent, beautiful musk, aquatic notes, and broxin, cedar, and amber. The one thing that I really don't pick up in this fragrance, I don't really pick up the white florals, they don't really pick up a whole lot of those aquatic notes. There's a little bit of saltiness in this composition, but not a whole lot, and I really don't detect those aquatic notes. Really, really what I'm picking up is the sweetness from the melon, the sweetness from the coconut, a whole lot of pina colada notes, a lot of pineapple. Like the pineapple really comes through, and I know it's not listed in the notes, but you really do smell it. The pineapple really does come through as this fragrance starts to develop. You've got that brightness in the top from the grapefruit. There's a nice, warm, woody aspect coming from the amber and coming from the woods that are in this fragrance. It's absolutely amazing. Now, one of the things I love about this fragrance, it's 120 bucks, right, for a 50 ml. You're going to get a whole lot of longevity with this fragrance, and you're going to get a whole lot of projection. The scent bubble on this is massive, and I love it. I'm here for it. If you guys don't like loud fragrances, you may not like this. It is very youthful. It is very memorable. You're going to be noticed. You're going to get compliments. And the scent bubble is bigger than an arm's length. People are going to notice you and you're going to get compliments. If you're one of those 14 sprayers, man, you're going to be smelling good for a couple days and maybe choke out some people in the room. I'm not sure. But to me, this fragrance just has a, an amazing scent trail. You're going to get eight plus hours on your skin and this stuff is going to sparkle and shine in the tropical climates. Once summer comes, it's gonna be really hot and really, really sticky. And so this fragrance is gonna work so well. But man, this is the ultimate tropical vacation vibe fragrance. I love it, I'm here for it. It's fruity, it's tropical, and it's very seductive. I saw this on Instagram, that's how I found them. I'll leave a link to them on Instagram, you can find them there. And like I said, look them up Check out their website where you see all their different offerings. They've got so many good ones. They've got Lido Life, which basically translates into beach life or pool life. Um, they've got, like, what is it, Grecian Grotto, which is another good one. So many good ones. And like I said, Siesta, uh, Sunset. Guys, I love their fragrances. They're so good. And uh, the presentation is cool. It's simple. It doesn't have to be, you know, 
very flashy, but it definitely gets the job done. This puts a smile on your face. You know, board, surfboard, flip-flops, board shorts, that's kind of the vibe you get with this. You know, just a real casual vibe. You guys can wear this fragrance anytime you want to. You can wear it right now. I like to wear a lot of fresh aquatic tropical fragrances this time of year when everything's dull and gray and the sun's not out and you just need, you know, a pick me up or something to lift you up and put a smile on your face. This will get the job done. There's nothing that says you can't wear, you know, fresh aquatics or tropical juicy fragrances. You know, and a lot of times when you have a fragrance that has so many of these sweet ingredients in it, you know, you can really get away with wearing them in the winter time as well. Uh, I love this fragrance. I'm giving it two thumbs way up, five stars. And I hate to say this, I always say test a fragrance. Man, this is blind buy worthy. I, 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 go ahead and kill me in the comments, but it is. It's amazing. It's one of my favorite pickups of 2023 that came out in 2022. So there you have it. Those are my impressions of Scent Journeys, Cocktails, and Catamarans. And guys, I cannot wait to get a whole lot more offerings from this house because it's first class. It's amazing. And uh, check it out. So have you guys tried anything from this house? If you have, leave a comment down below and tell me what is your favorite. Maybe some of you have tried Grecian Grotto. Maybe you've tried Siesta Sunset, Lido Life, whatever the case may be. Let me know down in the comments which is your favorite. And if you've never tried this house, I'd love to hear from you too. Tell me what are some of your favorite tropical niche our tropical designer doesn't matter. Leave a comment down below. I'd love to hear from you guys. And when you do, I'd love to know where you guys are commenting from. So, you know, drop me a line and tell me where you're from. I'd love to hear from you. And with that, guys, that's going to do it. I cannot wait to see you until the next video because I love chatting with you guys. I love talking with you guys about my favorite passion fragrances. And if you guys would love to be a part of my fragrance family, please hit that subscribe button down below and hit the bell notifications off the side. I'd love to have you. If you got some value from the video, which I know you did, please leave a thumbs up. It helps the algorithm and it helps this video get out to more people. So you'd be doing me a favor and you'd be helping the algorithm if you hit that thumbs up or thumbs down. Either one's going to help. It doesn't matter. Um, so I'd appreciate it. If you got some value, do that. Share the video with your friends and family and I'll see you in the next video. I hope you guys are having a happy new year and I hope wherever you are, this video finds you at peace and full of happiness. See you next time. Ciao.